The next group is the Shire of Eisenfair, and I will bring out Lord Brian Morgan to introduce the Shire of Eisenfair. Noble judges. <laughs> and you guys do. I would like to begin by offering you a bribe? These, these gifts. They, they are very expensive, high quality chocolate. They are a small bribe, I mean, token. <laughs> Please, I hope you enjoy <laughs> Years ago, Mistress Judith de Northumbria made the comment that in Eyes and Fear, we even made the rats dance. Naturally, we took that on as a badge of honor. So today, I'm going to present to you the dancing rats of Eyes and Fear. We're going to demonstrate for you the breadth and depth of the quality of dance in Eyes and Fear by performing for you three dances. We have a team of 12 here today. So there'll be a little bit of repetition between people, but I'm not gonna introduce everyone because it would take quite a while. <laughs> we'll be doing three dances. The first, an English country dance of 1651 from John Playford. The second, a dance from early 17th century Italy from uh, Master Cesare Negri. And the last one will be an original composition in the style of the great 15th century Italian dance masters. So I'd like to begin by introducing our first dance, which is Newcastle. This is a dance for eight people, and as mentioned, we have a large team here, and I'd like to call your attention especially to the dancers in this. <coughs> of the eight people in this dance, five of them are age 15 or under. In Eyes and Fear, we have dancers as young as six and as old as 85. As the Nicolessa said, we believe very much in the idea that dance is fun. And what we want you to see today is both the skill and <clears throat> fun that these people can have doing dance through all the ages. So please welcome our Eyes and Fear dancers for Newcastle. treatise by Cesare Negri of the Grazie de More, the thankfulness of love. <clears throat> this is Pizzeria de More, it's a dance for two couples. And 
Are those dancers ready? Yeah, he'll pick me up on the way. <laughs> well, so please welcome our dancers for Pizzeria de Morning. century dance masters like Abrio and, and Domenico and it's just a little bit of playful fun somewhat in the style of Petit Rien but not quite as fast but um, hitting on 
the romanticism and <clears throat> jealousy that is often seen in the dance of that period. This dance is Storzini. So, uh, also, Lord Daniel composed the music oh, for this. Oh, thank you. Yes, well. I, yes Lord, Lord Daniel composed the music. So this is an entirely original composition, both in dance and music. Thank you. 